Hello everybody and welcome back to Chicken, where we're so far not doing the greatest job. Um, we've lost one of our animals somewhere. We've lost all those chickens that we tamed at the beginning. Um, we have kind of a bit of a house, but it's not very big yet. And it's not very complete. And it's kind of lagging us out a bit. So one thing that I'm going to do to start this uh, episode off, I think we're going to have to make the house a bit smaller because I think it's going to just cause us some issues otherwise. Um, so we're just going to make it um, just this wide and move the walls in. And then we're going to maybe use some of the walls we've got just to make it a little bit nicer. Uh, just to sort of close it in and then maybe make some windows and one thing that i really want to do this episode is to make a bed because so far we've not got a bed and it's getting dark all the time and it's all horrible so i think we need just a little bed in our little house okay and that wall needed to come down anyway look it's completely out of line there we go. Unfortunately, in order to make beds, we need chicken bodies. And we don't really have any of those yet. So today's episode, I think we're going to be fighting chickens. Or chicken eggs, whichever. Uh, in order to be getting some uh, components for our bed. Right. There we are. So the floor is down. Look how much better the frame rate is. Just from taking a few blocks away. Okay. Let's just make this house a little bit. So basically you can make a huge house in this. You can try and be all fancy. Fancy schmancy. But if you do that. Hmm. E now does the inventory as well as rotating the blocks. Was it R? It's okay, maybe not. That was weird. Okay, never mind. So I just need uh, a couple more wall sections. Uh, let's see if we have any any more wood to make uh, some more. Yeah, we can make a few more logs there. We've actually got some logs here already. That should make us a few more wall sections. Oh, oh, this is much better. Yeah, big tip, don't make... Just don't even try making your house huge. It's just bad. Bad times. Right. Um, wall sections. Let's try five for now. We'll see how uh, how far that stretches. So we need one first, just coming out to the end there. One here. One here. I don't know how. I don't know if that needed to overlap a little bit. See, I'm putting more walls in. It's it's starting to have a few issues again. And I need... Oh no, do you know what? I can't do that. Because I can't get to my crafting bench to make a door now. Oops. That was a silly idea. Okay, now we can get in. So I need a door. How do I make one of those? Just with some logs again. Now then, does a door just go through? Oops, that wasn't what I wanted. Does a door just go through the wall or does it, is it its own entity? It's quite big. Yeah, do, you, do the walls around it? Um, it looks like you might have to, because it doesn't seem to just bed into the walls. Okay. So that 
that's lesson learned on that one. Build the door first. Put it where you want. It's similar to what we did with the gates, really. Build the door. Then build the rest of it. Oh, no. Have we got any sticks? Yeah, we've got tons. I'll just do it with a stick. Okay, so door. Door time. Guessing we want the handle on the outside. And um, we probably want it about there. Oh, look, it looks like a house already. How beautiful. So then we're going to need to fill that gap in with a bit of wall. Which it seems happy enough to do. And that there with a bit of wall as well. Yeah, it's looking like a proper place now. Key to use the door. Door opens. And I can jump through. Okay. We need we, we really need steps in this game, I think. Definitely add it to my huge massive re feature request list. So we don't need that wall, so that can just go away in a chest somewhere in case we need it later. Now, how do we make roof? Um, we can have a wooden roof or... That's it at the moment by the looks of it. And that's, again, nine logs. We can still make more logs out of the trunks we've got. Um... I don't know if I'm going to be able to get up to the roof to put these on, but we'll see what we can do. Uh, we'll definitely see what we can do right here. Uh, oh, how does this work then? I jump onto my wall? No. Do I need like a really tall creature to help me? Probably. I wonder if I can jump on my workbench. Actually, I'll take that out of my inventory until I'm in the right place and then jump up onto my wall. No. If I can't do this soon, then I'll just go and make a bed and we'll give up on the roof. Maybe, uh, uh, maybe platforms can go up on top. Yeah, they can, but it's not really like high enough. Hmm. I think I might need to build more wall on top of, let's try this. Can I build more walls on top of my walls? As an experimental thing, can we do that? Can we get high enough to do that? No. Hmm. Anything else that I can place on the ground and jump on to get up to these walls. This is Minecraft style thinking, this is. Okay, if I put a roof section down, can I climb up it? To get up to the top. Can I use roof like steps? Uh, evidently yes, we can. And then can I get myself up here? Yeah. And then I can start building the roof. And the roof kind of needs to be uh, this way around. Oh, this is difficult to align. Uh... Okay, we'll just put you there, okay? Um, and we'll see how that looks. Hmm, yeah, that would be okay, I think. 
So I think the way to do it with roofs is to make the roof into a ramp so that you can get up to the top. Make extra roof sections to get up to the top. Climb up the roof. And then add it to the top of the walls. Come on, you can climb up this thing. You did it a minute ago. Okay, let's try it with nothing in my hands. No, why did this work before and it doesn't work now? I don't understand. Okay, the lag is really coming back as well. So I think we're going to leave the house with just no roof for now. Oops. But I think there's a lot you could do with this building sort of model. I think once it gets a little bit more a little bit more optimised, we're going to be having some fun with this. As I say, my main thing for today, uh, we're probably going to end up being in the dark now. So I think I might need to take my lantern with me. Which is a bit of a risk. But um, I don't think chickens are too hard to... But I think that the fact that that's inside has made it into, like, stairs. So that might be a way to access an upper level. So if you're, you've made, like, a, a load of um, platforms on the top, then put a roof section in, and that seems to almost act like stairs. So that is maybe something that someone who's struggling to find out what stairs are they might find that useful um for me i think if i try and do anything more than this tiny little shack i've got then i'm gonna probably not be able to play the game so <laughs> we'll keep up with that one right now light bulb kitty where are you you know what maybe i should make if i'm gonna fight probably need another hatchet and I think I did have iron back at the house so let's do that before we go and maybe put some of my horse bodies and things like that away we're just going to go out with just our hatchet if we see light bulb kitty along the way all the better why is stuff not going in the chest go in that's better. I love that the creatures snore in this. They sound so happy when they do it as well. Right, I need food. I don't need all of this. Uh, I need that. I don't need that. Probably need those. Uh, iron ore. Maybe make a couple of hatchets, actually, if I can. Right, let's see what I can do. I might run out of logs, actually. Oh, no, I had uh, tree trunks in there, so that's good. Right, chest. This Workbench. Okay, workbench. We need vines so we can get a pet tag. Uh, right. Hatchet logs another hatchet do they stack? no another hatchet uh, that should do um, where did, oh yeah my lamp is on the wall so I can take that I really hope that's in my inventory apparently not where did it go? Is it outside? Did it knock through the wall? <gasps> no, my lamp! Okay, another tip. Uh, be very, very careful when it comes to lamps. Apparently they are not very, um, very tough. Oh, and I need sap for it as well. 
Oh no. Hmm. I think we need sap for torch as well. Right, we're just gonna fight stuff in the dark like the beasts we are. Yes, let's go. Shut my door. Because why not? Now, I'm thinking that possibly a good source of chickeny bodies would be these guys up the hill. Now, by the way, running around um, in, on the simple graphic settings, perfectly fine by the looks of it. It is just, it really just seems to be, it's just holding its own. Um, it just seems to be around the house that we're having difficulties now. Okay, there's a lot of you here. I wonder if I can just quickly nick this egg. Or if they're all going to just descend on me. We'll see. Quick, run away! Oh no. Okay. See, the horses didn't mind me going after their egg. But my goodness, did those chickens mind it. I got a chicken head. We'll put it in our box. Anything that we get will go in our box. And I'll quickly like nip back and see if they're still mad with me. Come on, go in the chest. Good. Got quite a bit of room in these chests, it's quite good. And again, we're gonna shut my door. Haven't fed the giraffe dude in a while. And considering I've locked him up, I think we really should feed him. So I'll throw a few things in the pen for him. Assuming he's still alive. Oh, he is still alive. That's good. There you go, dude. Have some stuff. Oops. You have to throw it really precisely. There you go. Dinner. Okay, let's go see if we can find our stuff. Oh, you can hear him munching away in the background. Go, little dude. like it's like when you're in a nature documentary and we're looking at the behavior of the green-legged chickens they're a very rare specimen they cheep when they're snoring it's not usual to see so many in a group okay <laughs> seem to be sleeping so I can look around and see if I can find my loot bag in the dark it's got all my hatchets in it like seriously dudes was it this group or was it the, the other group over there was that where I left it I might not find this till the morning you know this I'm not going to do much good at fighting without a hatchet And I don't know where... Oh. oh, where's my loot bag? I don't have a hatchet anymore. Right, I don't think that they just spawn too quickly. So um, I think our best bet might actually be just to go back. If I see like Bob Kitty, I'll retrieve her. I don't know where she's gone. Which is a shame she's a very good source of light and she has my only saddle on her oh frames have dropped now they're like oh how dare you i 
And maybe we should kill some chickens closer to home as well, because I really don't want to be dealing with this night thing for too many more episodes. Come on. Chug away, game. There, it's recovered itself. Right, okay. Let's get inside our really dark house now. I'm going to make a new hatchet. Or maybe even a few new hatchets. And we are going to use them to fight any chickens we see. Maybe two at the most, actually. I don't want to lose too many. Because we'll burn through all of our iron ore way too quickly. I'm not really sure. Like, the furnace doesn't seem to smelt. Um, oh, actually, that's not going to help my frames. Leaving stuff lying on the floor. Um, doesn't seem to really smelt anything yet. So I'm wondering whether there's plans to put some extra stuff in. Involving that. Right, now I think I saw a chicken sort of round here. I could just maybe cull it for its chickeny goodness. I don't really want to do that. I'd rather get eggs, but uh, needs must sometimes. I mean, that's dark. It's so annoying. I want to be able to go home and just sleep in my bed and turn it to day. I really hope that's how it works. If not, that could be disappointing. Um, I can hear buck, buck, bucking. There were some chickens, like, just normal chickens up the hill. If I just find one that's, like, on its own, I can just get it. And I think I need, like, six chicken bodies and some wood or something to get a, a bed. I can hear the clucking. Let's hone in on it. We have to use all our senses in this darkness. Ah, it's one of the big ones. No, I, I need a, just a normal chicken. I think. Because otherwise they're just going to kill me. I think the normal ones are not so bad. Uh, it'll be daytime soon as well. There's so many of them too now. So they, they're going to gang up on me. And I can't even see where I am. I need to find normal chickens. Ones that aren't crazy and hiss at me. See, that one wasn't happy that I was near its territory. It was like, get off my land. So I just need normal chickens that are nice and easy to get. And if I can do that, then we can have a bed. Normal chickens! I see you there. Being all chickeny. I'm coming to get you. Hopefully, there's only a couple as well, so they're not going to all gang up on me too much. If I die to a normal chicken, I'll not be happy. Okay, quick. Okay, they're running. They're running away. Oh, he's too fast for me. Come back here. I'm literally following his icon right now. Is he there? Right. Got him. Right, we have chicken bodies. They've scattered a bit. So it looks like normal chickens just run away when you attack them. We could make a mega chicken out of all the other bits. 
Come here. Stop running away. I need like six of your bodies. Come here. Leading me onto cactuses. I see your game. Right, there's two. I'm a horrible murdering person, aren't I? But it's okay, I can give them new life as a feather bed. Right, there's the rest of them. So we have two down, I think four to go. I wonder if I can check the recipe. Yeah. Oh, eight chicken bodies, really? That's loads. So many chicken bodies. we we'll do some underwater fighting. We just have to remember to come up for breath. Okay, that one's too fast. Ah, I'm in the water now. I hate being in the water. I always worry I'll drown. So this one, I'll approach from the other side and hope it doesn't run into the water. That could be bad times. Right, come on you. This is maybe why we have a slingshot. <laughs> I've just realised this. Things run away. That's why I need a slingshot. He tried to he tried to fight back that one. Okay, here's chicken number four. Up here. And then I'm gonna see if I can find my loot bag off those other stupid chickens. Now it's light. Those evil green-legged chickens. They are my sworn enemies now. Well, they made me lose my loot bag. There are four. Four now. Right. The strange horse is there. They are backwards. They are so backwards. They can't even eat properly. I'm sure someone designed them with their heads on the wrong way. Maybe they were, you know, they, you know, they were a bit stressed and they weren't looking at that blue arrow. They were like, yeah, well, yeah, I've designed loads of these creatures. And they just did it back to front. Okay. A couple more to go. Come on. Run, 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 run. Okay, I think, I think it's going to be one more chicken to kill. And I think the bed might have to wait to the next episode. Oh, there's my loot bag. Okay, let's get all my stuff back. Oh, wow, I managed to get a reptile limb. I can have something with one reptile limb. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I have this weird creature with like all different kinds of legs because I haven't got like any creature parts. Right, okay, we've probably lost that chicken now. Oh no, we haven't. Okay, that's five chicken pieces. Um, but I think, you know, we've run out of time for today. So I'm going to sign off here. Um, do we even have... Ah yes, we have some cooked melon, that's fine. To eat before we sign off. So I hope you liked the episode, even though all we really did was run around in the dark um, chasing chickens. But we did build quite a lot more on our base, so that's really good as well. Uh, I wish I could have got a roof on, but maybe when things get a little bit more uh, optimised and stuff, we'll be able to um, have a bit more mobility so we can sort of climb up onto the top of the house and get the roof on, which will be fantastic. Um, the search for the missing cat, I'm going to put up some 
while I'm off camera put up some lost cat signs and maybe we'll find light bulb kitty uh, so if you liked the episode anyway please leave me a like in the, the comment section below and if you want to follow chicken a little bit further with me then please subscribe to the channel in the meantime though look after yourselves and keep being awesome